Hello everyone, today we're going to be creating a calculator. First you're going to go to REPL and create a new Python and you can name it whatever you want. Then let's start the coding. From, you're first going to type from fraction import fraction, which basically gives you the ability to start to to start using fractions. After that, uh, you're going to, let me just move this up here. But you're going to go, uh, you're going to print how you can print anything you want. You today, buddy, and you could say like something, don't respond. That's something that uh, works and with me. Next, what you're going to do is um so after you do that you're gonna have to define all of your functions so i already have this uh memorized up but you can uh, copy this but so you're gonna do define out of the function this is all the code you're gonna need to start um uh, this is the exponent symbol in coding and now we're going to define the calculator and pause the video if you think i'm going too fast and it's totally fine if you think I'm doing that. So you could say that uh, x equals to fraction input input um enter enter your first fraction or decimal. Your first fraction or decimal. Fraction slash. Doesn't matter. And then you can do that and close that. Now that you have that done, let me just indent this twice. Now, you're going to do the exact same thing, except now you're going to change it to Y. Enter your, so just copy this entire thing and go here and paste it. And you're going to change this to second and this to a Y. So that will work. Now, don't worry about those errors because, so since we already defined add underscore fractions, we could uh, use these function right here, and we could say all we need to do is we could just uh, straight up copy this and paste it. Oops, what am I meant to do there? And then we're going to do that for all of them. So subtract underscore fractions x comma y. And then just enter multiply underscore fraction by underscore fractions x y and then you wait x y and then place that divide underscore fractions this is basically all the same function from above but you're just pasting them here. Average underscore fractions. And you want to do that. Exponent underscore fractions. X, Y. Wait. Yeah. So that, that's essentially the first step to creating this calculator. Now, that pretty much occupies a lot of space. Now, let's go down here. And let's define this function so that it will go over and over again. So we're going to say calculator underscore again 
equals input of actually I already have this written down so pause the video if you uh, want any help with this but here's my code that you can use then then you're going to add this piece of code which will make you run this function over and over and over again okay there this should work it calculate wait what did i say up there oh i said calculator I meant to say. So this is how it should be. Refraction and decimal 21. See some of numbers. And this will keep on going until you finish this. This is essentially the first step. After you do that, you can rerun the program. And this is my friends how you can make your own calculator.